Hello guys, Tiger Blow Neil here. And uh, today I just want to make a quick video on something that I've been thinking about the last few days. And uh, how it has changed my life and how I can't just do it when I want to now. Um, basically, if you don't know, I'm a parent now. I've got a two-year-old daughter. And um, finding time to game and play on games in general is not as easy as it used to be when I didn't have a child. Basically... Now you've got to kind of work around having a child if you want to go and play your games and do your gaming videos. And um, that's something that I've found really challenging. It's been different. Um, but I don't know what you guys think about that. Um, if any of you are any used parents and, now, and you love gaming but now you feel like you can't game because you could have work and then you've got to... You come in from work, you get home, you've got to look after your child and then by the time your child's asleep... You might be tired so you don't have time to play your games anymore. And it might just be one of them things now for you. Um, I've got to admit, I've, I, I've had to adapt a little bit just because um, I used to game all the time. Like literally, when I when I didn't have a kid, I used to go to work or um, whatever, go out, uh, see friends. But then I know that I had the free time to go home and game and play on Call of Duty all the time and play on FIFA all the time and I could just do what I want so it's it's definitely a compromise and a, and a it's for the best so you love your kid you know what I mean so it's not like you're like oh I've got to watch the kid because I can't play games it's like you're not like in a mood but it's like you want a game still in your life as well after working hard at work and stuff like that so <clears throat> the things I've realized that I've got to do is Whenever the kid, the me baby has a nap, that's when I can jump on. Or say, me, uh, I've got a girlfriend. Say, if she goes out with the baby, say they go shopping or they do something together for the day, then I can jump on my game then as well. And it's like them things you take advantage now of when your child isn't there with you. Say, if someone else is looking after them. But, um,. Also, maybe try, if it's kid-friendly, maybe try and get your, your kid involved with the game as well. Uh, there's times where I've been sitting playing on it and she'll come and sit next to us and she'll want to have a little go of the control and stuff. So, it's there's stuff like that you can try as well. But it's, um, basically, this video, I'm making this video just because I haven't seen many other videos with people talking about it, which I find quite fascinating because there's so many gamers who were younger and now they're a bit older and they've got a kid or they've got kids and they still game, but no one's really put videos up about how, they, how they've how they adapted. Especially if you're like a gaming addict and you love gaming like I do. It, 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 it does change your life because you don't have all the time in the world anymore. You've got responsibilities, you've got stuff to do. Like, at one point you go to work, but then the rest of the day you could game. But now... It's not all. It's not always like that. You've got a kid. You've, you're raising a kid. Um, so these are just. They, they were just a couple of tips that I would suggest. Maybe when someone else is looking after your child, say if you've got a partner, if the mom's looking after the child, if the mother's looking after the child, um, and if hopefully you've got a good your child's a good sleeper. So if they go to bed on time. You've still got the evening and some of the night to play. So I definitely play more now at night time when my girlfriend and the baby are asleep. And then I'm like, all right, I can fit a couple hours in here and there. Um, but I, I have work really early at like 6 a.m. So I can't stay up too late. Although I sometimes do stay up late and I just go to work tired. It's just, it's how it works. It's like a circle. It's like sometimes I'll go to work go to bed at a good time so I can have a good sleep but then other times I want to have a game gaming session so I risk I risk it and I'm tired at work and with the new Call of Duty coming out and Battlefield 1 just coming out you know it's you want to game a lot if you're fans of FPS games so it's just one of them things being a parent and gaming it's crazy it's a crazy situation you can't always do one thing and the other and stuff like that so uh, yeah, I just thought I'd do a video because I've ne I haven't really seen many people do these videos. So, uh, in the comment section, put down if you have got any experiences as a parent and you want a game, but you feel like you haven't got time to game anymore. Or what what's your tips to other dads and other parents about how to deal with it? Because they were just a few of mine, which I do. And if you want to do that, try it. But um, 
yeah, yeah, comment in the comment section, guys. Uh, leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you later. Bye-bye.